So there are over 20,000 bee species worldwide, and they're an important part of our ecosystem, whether we like them or not. Right, and Dennis is joining us with a local bee expert. Hello, Dennis. Hello, hello. We are standing next to this huge swarm of bees. Let me uh, hop over to the other side really quick so that um, I can get on the same side as Bill here, as he is the expert. I don't want to agitate them. <laughs> so, Bill, uh, you know, this is kind of what you get called for. Like, if the, a swarm comes in, um, just tell me a little bit about what we're looking at. So a swarm of bees is essentially um, the way that a colony of bees reproduces itself. The, the laying queen and probably about half the population will leave their um, existing nest, which could be a st these stacks of boxes over here, and she will try and go out and find a new place to, um, to a new cavity to, for, for them to start a new colony in. Mm -hmm. At the original um, site, they will be raising new queens, which we call virgin queens. They haven't, they haven't mated yet. And so th this one will find the cavity, which I believe they they have. It they're going. Like they did, yeah. Yeah, they're going to move into this uh, th this aban this old uh, abandoned tree trunk, mm -hmm. and um, so at the original location, that that virgin queen essentially once once they've kind of settled down a bit, she will fly out. She'll mate with the with drones, uh, which are the males, and then she'll fly back, and 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 within a week or so, she'll start laying eggs, and the whole cycle starts all over again. Mm -hmm. And then bringing something like this to, you know, these stacks that you have over here, kind of, um, how does that happen? Well, I, 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 will, I, I get phone calls from people all around the city. Um, uh, then they report swarms. They, they're in their trees. They're in their bushes. They're wherever. Uh, there, there's, uh, be, so beekeepers would go out with a box, or sometimes I use a vacuum. I would vacuum that uh, swarm up. Uh, or dump it into a box, and then once that once they have basically gone into the box, you close it up and take it to one of your bee yards, and then they become essentially managed honeybees um, in the commercial style beekeeping boxes. Got it. All right. Well, Megan Cena, we're gonna get a look inside one of the boxes next time you all come to us. So for now, I'll test it back over to you.